What's going on y'all? It's Richie here and today we're taking on the third of six Hateful's and today I did something a little bit different. I left in my failed attempt to make a couple of points. If you want to see the successful attempt, you can skip forward to about a minute and a half. What I wanted to talk about here is you're going to see me take a lot of damage right here, mistiming stuff, and then you're going to see me do something stupid, try to recall the axe in the middle of his projectile, and at the very beginning of the fight, we're down to no health. Uh, this is a failed attempt. I struggle to get him even halfway. Uh, but the follow-up at a minute and a half is me taking one hit the entire time. The, the point of this is, is you can make mistakes in one fight. Just don't pile on. Just don't let it keep coming back to bite you. So, a couple things about this one. Classic Dragon move when they charge up, you want to stay away from them. Because uh, they are invincible, and once they are attacked, they will explode and do a ton of damage. So, classic drug here. The, the difference between this one and the rest of them is he is by himself. And I kept expecting follow-up Draugr's to come in, and you see me just absolutely mistime that very bad. But the successful attempt is coming up, and... This is what you want to focus on. If you skip forward this far, here's what you want to do. Here's the blueprint to this fight. Once he first emerges, you can do a ton of damage very quickly since you have everything powered up. It's almost a, almost a, it's more than a half bar right out of the gate. A lot of parrying in this one, but you have to be careful when he charges up. He is invincible, and there's an AoE explosion. Does a lot of damage. I wanted to name this video something like, you know, only took one hit, almost perfect, but it wasn't. It took me three or four attempts, and I finally started learning from my mistakes. And that's all you gotta do with this game, is their moveset's not gonna change unless they have different phases, you know? and as long as you are paying attention, you're going to be able to correct any mistakes you're making. And this fight really wasn't that bad. Once I started focusing, paying attention to his moves, I definitely went into this fight since I had already beaten two, thinking, oh, this is a piece of cake. It, it was pretty easy, but not without focus. A lot of parrying. Just remember those yellow rings you have to parry. You cannot block. Or it's going to stun you and he's going to follow up. And do some damage. Also keep in mind, my parrying here, I, I am using the shield that is designed to parry. If you're struggling with that, it may be the shield you're using. But as you can see here, I haven't taken a hit yet. And... I was so upset. I was so upset. Oh, I was so upset. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, this this fight really isn't that bad. You just kind of keep your distance. Just pay attention. I am still currently looking for the other three Hatefuls, and I'm really excited to finish this side quest out. Moving forward. Keep on persevering, y'all. You can do it. And let the rest of the fight play out. Comment down below with any additional content you want to see. Come back for more guide videos. Have a good one. Reminds me of tales of a cruel empress, one too angry to die. We will see.